you. Thank you so much for joining us here today. Can you take a moment to introduce yourself and your company for our audience? Yeah, Grant, it's a pleasure to be here. I'm Himanshu Gadgil. I'm the CEO of Enzyme Biosciences Limited. Uh, we are a biopharmaceutical CDMO based in India and in the US. Can you tell us a little bit about the recent launch of Enzyme's uh, Disease Services Division? Yeah, so you know we've, we've been having a lot of clients that we service for uh, phase one clinical development and manufacturing, and a lot of them requested th that maybe perhaps if we could start supporting them from an earlier stage. Uh, so with that in mind, uh, we've, we've uh, inaugurated our new discovery services setup back in India. That'll allow us to uh, provide service to a client right from their discovery needs and all the way to clinical and then to commercial manufacturing. Let's talk a little bit about. Um, there's been a big push from the company about continuous bioprocessing. Can you just talk about the benefits of that relative to you know your traditional batch processing? We are one of the first movers in uh, developing the continuous manufacturing process and in fact we are one of the perhaps the only CDMO that has an end-to-end -end continuous manufacturing uh, that starts from uh, perfusion all the way to uh, drug substance manufacturing in a straight through connected mode. Uh, the biggest advantage of course of this uh, technology is um, from cost of goods reduction. So we generally see a 40 to 50 percent reduction in cost of goods uh, than conventional uh, fed batch manufacturing processes and then of course the other advantage is because it's a very small footprint so in a 1500 square foot we can manufacture up to 10 kilograms right now currently um, there's a huge uh, carbon footprint savings also from a sustainability perspective a little bit about uh, you know the benefits of a fully connected system, like how that influences your strategic, strategic priorities, innovation, growth, etc. Yeah. So um, when we started out, you know what we wanted to do was to really address this cost of manufacturing for biologics, and we realized to do that we would have to have a very small footprint. And hence, in um, connecting all the unit operations was very important to achieve that. So Enzyme X 1.0, which is our first platform, uh, is at a 500 liter scale, where all of the unit operations are fully connected, and we can get 10 kilograms per batch currently. How is uh, Enzyme working to address the challenges of scalability and production efficiency in biomanufacturing? Good question, Grant. We are currently at 10 kilogram scale. What we want to achieve is a 40 kilogram per batch scale. For that, we are scaling up from uh, a 500 liter manufacturing uh, platform to a 1,000 liter manufacturing platform. In the next year or so, we should be able to scale to that 1,000 liter. And with newer, uh, better cell lines that give you a much higher productivity, we are very confident that we are going to reach the 40 kilogram um, per batch scale for our continuous manufacturing. Along with that, in Enzyme X 2.0, we are going to also have process analytical tools that will be integrated with our continuous manufacturing, which will take it up to the next level where analytics also will be in line and real time. Do you have any final thoughts you'd like to leave our audience with? Enzyme X 1.0 is an incredible platform that allows uh, our partners to have a more cost-effective biomanufacturing process for their novel molecules. For molecules which are difficult to express in fed batch, it proves even more beneficial. We get almost 80% reduction in cost of goods for molecules that are difficult to express. Most of the newly engineered, human engineered molecules tend to be unstable, difficult to express. That is where Enzyme X really excels. And when we go to Enzyme X 2.0, we are really going to take it up to that next level where any modality would work beautifully with this platform. So we are looking forward for, to bring that technology to our partners. Hey, Manchu, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Grant.